Hello guys, welcome to my video series tutorial to talk about Microsoft Schematic Kernel. In this video, I am going to focus on how to use Handlebar Planner when you are using Chat Completion Service. For example, in our last video, we talked about Google Gemini A model. In that one, to connect this one, we have to use Chat Completion Service to get our output. If you are using this chat completion service, you cannot simply use handlebar planner because the code is straightforward. You have to create the kernel object. If any plugin is needed, you have to add the plugin. Finally, you have to use iChat completion service to get the result. So how to implement this handlebar planner in chat completion service? The next scenario, how to use handlebar planner plugin? These are the two scenarios we are going to talk about in this video. Let's start how to implement this feature. This demo based on our handlebar planner demo, which we already talked about this one. So I copied all the supported files, plugin folder and the config folder. So I copied, I created a new project. The next step in program.cs file, while creating the kernel builder, we are adding our supported plugin. This plugin, I'm not going to straightforward add into this create kernel builder object. I'm, I have created one new plugin called weather history plugin. In this plugin, I'm going to add this plugin information. Here I have created my plugin function called collect weather history info. Here I'm going to add my plugin. To add this plugin, I need kernel object. So here we are using builder object. We added all the plugins and finally we create the kernel object. So we cannot simply use this builder object. We have to use the kernel object only. So the first argument here, I'm going to pass kernel here variable name kernel. I use the same name here. Here I'm going to create one variable called kernel copy. Kernel dot clone. Why I used to clone? This we'll talk about a little bit later. At the moment, just understand we clone the object assigned to one variable. Using this variable, I'm going to add my plugin information. So I just copy this plugin code and paste it here. As I mentioned, we cannot simply use a builder. We have to use the kernel copy here. So instead of builder, used kernel copy dot import plugin from prompt directory. This one we have to use. So the same parameter I just copy paste. Remove this one. Instead of location plugin name, I used name of variable. This one plugin directory. So same way we have to use kernel copy dot plugins dot add from object. Here we have to pass our external weather plugin object. So I just copy this one, pass it. The next argument plugin name, I'm passing my plugin name also, class name only. External weather plugin added. So this code is not required. The next changes I'm going to do before adding this plugin, first I have to check whether this plugin available in the kernel copy or not. If it is available, no need to add. So this condition also I'm going to add. This we'll talk about little bit later. So the first condition I'm going to check if kernel copy plugins not contains add this one. The same for weather plugin also. That's it. So we check the condition, we added it. Once plugin is ready, in our handlebar planner demo, what we did, 
we created the plugin the next step we call handleball planner related code so i just copy the complete code go to weather plugin here i paste this one i don't want to this uh, display plan here i remove this code and execute plan fine just return the result remove it created our planner object also while creating the plan we have to pass our prompt so what is our goal we have to set it so that information also we going to pass dynamically here i am adding the second argument is a goal so here fulfilled the next step we cannot simply use only the string goal because in main program while we need history and weather information this function get invoked by the kernel in general it simply pass only the city name only it's not provided the complete details because handlebar planner needed the complete details if you pass simply city it's not able to understand so it it might be a problem so we have to set the goal complete description we have to set it for that here i'm going to add description so the description description i'm going to inform kernel hey i need a complete information about the goal so here i just mentioned describe the user goal it in just for one or two lines to ensure full full context is provided so whenever the function get called by kernel it's not simply provide only the city name it's provide the complete information so what the kernel is needed while running the application we see this complete goal so here everything fine and one more changes we have to do so once the kernel copy has been created we have to remove this plugin also because this plugin name also related to weather history plugin maybe handlebar plan while creating the plan it used this weather history plugin also mostly it don't happen but it might be happen so what we have to do we have to remove this weather history plugin in the kernel copy also that also we have to do in this step once the kernel copy has been created here i'm going to remove my current plugin so here we just add the code kernel copy dot plugins dot remove kernel copy dot plugins here we have to specify the plugin name so the plugin name here is weather history plugin that's it before processing it to handlebar planner we remove the current plugin in the kernel object seems to be our code is fine we move to the main program.cs file the main program.cs file here i am creating the kernel object in this kernel object i am going to add my weather history plugin here we add builder dot plugins dot add from type weather history plugin the name of the plugin same class name we had we are going to pass both get matched so this name of the plugin and remove the plugin both get matched okay so our base is ready the next step we should call the this chat completion service copy the complete code user message prompt this one copy complete code and uh, paste it here
the user message i am going to remove this one because i need the history information only so here i define my goal where goal the goal we have already specified yeah this one i just copy this and uh, paste here so the goal is ready the goal i'm going to pass it here and one more ch main changes we have to do in the settings we have to set the tool call behavior we have to set it here whether you have to enable kernel function or based on that you have to set it here i'm going to set auto invoke kernel function that's it this settings has to passed here and the last argument also we have to specify the kernel this also we have to pass it permission also passed seems to be all fine in our main program so we connected the chat completion service get the result and weather plugin first we added all the plugin information and uh, handlebar planner we created the plan uh, this is mistake I have to pass the kernel copy variable, not the kernel, because we clone the object. In the clone the object only, we added all our plugin information. One more changes I'm going to do instead of lo the local variable, just define the global here. So kernel, kernel copy here. In case if this function get repeatedly called in different different scenarios no need to add again and again all the plugin information so i moved into the kernel copy is a global and i can take the copy so every time if we assign it the copy here we have to remove it the our mother main plugin that also has been removed you can check the condition also here we simply change the code if kernel copy null assign it and remove it that's it so we change the code also and execute plan also we are using the kernel here also i have to change to the kernel copy that's it seems to be all fine go to the main program.cs file put the breakpoint line number 30 and another breakpoint in line number 44 i do one more i had just i print the plan also right line handlebar plan dot to string simple and start the application ah it's hit okay no problem here the plugin there is no plugin available because we remove the main plugin in the clone so we go one by one step by step it's not does not contain the plugin so we added the same for weather plugin added and we created the planner and creating the plan plan has been created move to the next step we just print the plan so getting weather detail for Chennai and weather information available and history related finally concordinate the string and get the result and one more actually I have to show here the goal so the goal here the kernel provided the complete information the user wants to know the historical and weather detail for chennai initially we assigned the our goal is provide me with the historical and weather detail chennai and kernel provided the complete string user wants to know it's based on each call it will change but the main understanding here is you have to provide the complete description otherwise it won't give the uh, you know pass the complete information to the goal it's only record argument only should passed if you are not provided the description only the city name you get it and maybe problem while creating the plan that's the reason we have to clearly provide our description to get our goal finally we get the result invoke 
we get the result so weather details currently some information historical information about chennai also so the next statement we run it we should hit uh, here the response yeah so we just print the result if we go to the console application we can see the this part we can see it chennai formally known as some other information unfortunately weather are currently unable to provide weather information of chennai because you did not see the weather because in the weather plugin i just written it i did not call the external api to get weather information just written we are currently unable to provide the weather information that's it that's the reason the weather information is not available in the output understanding we get the history information and the weather information this is a way we can add the handlebar concept using the chat completion service and using into the plugin